Welcome to reading everyone. My name is Elaine Blakely and I am the teacher for tier three reading class. Um, a little bit about me. I grew up from Vermilion. I grew up in Vermilion, Ohio, and I went to Bowling Green State University for my undergrad. And then about five years into teaching, I went back and got my master's in curriculum and instruction. Um, I have three little ones, four, two, and four months, and I've been married for nine years. I became a teacher because I loved school. It was something I always just really enjoyed. And then as I got older, I realized that not everyone loved it as much as I did. And I, that really bothered me. Um, so I'm hoping my class can be a class that your students enjoy and want to come to. And so that's sort of always my goal. I love middle school students because as much as I love school, middle school is an awkward time for everybody. And I like being there for them and knowing that at the end of the day, they're still just kids, even though they're way too cool to admit they're just kids, they are still just kids. And that's why I love middle school. Um, I'm so excited to be in school again and seeing everybody half face to face. It's right where we want to be. So let me tell you a little bit about our classroom. This is our class. Um, the kids' desks are numbered and they sit every other desk or there's enough space between them. Back here is a bookshelf and over on this side is a magazine rack and another bookshelf back there. Um, one of the things I always tell the kids is any reading is good reading. And so I don't care what they pick up to read when it's time to read. If they wanna read a graphic novel, if they wanna read a comic book, if they wanna read a magazine, all of that to me is reading. So go for it. Um, a little bit about reading class. It is a tier three class, so it's scheduled into their day. They're not pulled out of another class. Some may split with another special or academic sport or math lab, but they don't get pulled out of that class. It's one day with me, one day with the other class. Um, this is what Lexia looks like. I know that students have used Lexia at the elementary level, but this program is specifically designed for our six through eight students. Um, it's comprehension word study, which is vocabulary and grammar. It, they take a pretest, so it's at their level. I typically always assign comprehension first because it's typically what we're struggling with the most. I may have individual students who start with word study. Don't let this 45 minutes scare you. We don't sit and do 45 minutes of Lexia. I typically do 15 minutes, 10 to 15 minutes a day, unless we're doing something else and we don't get to it that day. But Lexia is kind of the core of our program. Um, the other activities we do really range. I used to do theme weeks where I'd get a bunch of books in the library and everything would be about that theme, sports or animals or you know, around the world, whatever it may be. I'm trying to figure out how to do that this year with our rules so that kids aren't sharing the same books. So that may take me a little bit to get creative, but we're going to do it again. We also do escape rooms and mysteries and anything I can do that doesn't make them feel like they're just sitting and reading every single day. Not that we won't be doing a ton of reading. As far as homework, I don't give any. Um, it's an intervention class, so it's a class they're struggling with. So there's no reason for me to send something home that they may struggle with at home. Language arts can be where they get their homework, but for me, there's no homework. So if you see anything on their Schoology and they're like, I don't know, I didn't do that. It was an activity we're going to do in class or did in class and you don't need to worry about it. As far as grading, it is a graded class. However, I'm very much a fan of them redoing work. So if you see a low grade, they can certainly ask me to redo something. Um, they, you know, they have as much time as they need to do that. And so I will put the low grade in after a week from the assignment, and then they have as much time as they need to redo it. Selexia, this is what our typical day looks like. They'll come in, they'll see a screen. Um, this was before they took their pretest, though there's no Lexia. Uh, Schoology has their bell ringers. We'll go over the bell ringers together, and then we'll do some sort of activity. Um, I am trying to practice everything digitally for right now. I typically like paper and pencil better, but just with the unknown this year, we want to make sure that they know how to use everything with minimal frustration. I am so excited to be working with your students this year. I'm so excited we're back in the buildings. I miss them. Please reach out with any questions you may have about the program or how they're doing or anything that you may need. I look forward to hearing from you and I hope everybody has a great year. Thank you so much.